a home tonight. This fire tore through their apartment complex. 7 News reporter Kirsten Glavin at the scene of the Kensington Apartments early today. She filed this update. Officials are working to figure out what caused this fire to start this morning. You can see a lot of the damage off behind me here is toward the center of the building right on the roof. And we're told that 12 of these units were damaged. Several are a complete loss. I want to show you some of the video we have of the blaze. This was taken by a neighbor on her cell phone. You can see large flames and heavy black smoke billowing into the air. We're learning it was a maintenance worker who helped save the day. He actually came in early and says he saw a little bit of smoke coming from the roof and quickly ran from door to door telling people to evacuate. Just minutes later, he says the building was pretty much engulfed. You don't know exactly what you're about to run into in the next breezeway. But you know, it, you know that people's in there, so you go let them know, get out. God puts people in places for whatever reason. This morning, I showed up to work a little early. The Taylor's fire chief says to his knowledge, no one was hurt. Now, there were some rumors circulating this morning saying that someone was transported by EMS. He says he can't confirm that, and we did reach out to Greenville County EMS to see if they could tell us anything. They said they couldn't because of privacy concerns. In Taylor's, I'm Kirsten Glavin, 7 News. Here's another fire under.